since we talked about commercial, why don't we talk about single family? Because the residential housing market is experiencing a whole bunch of trouble right now, allegedly. So single family rents are in trouble. That's kind of a topic that's popping up. U.S. annual rent growth slows to nearly a two-year low in January, CoreLogic reports. Single family rent price growth was up by 5.7% year over year in January of 2023, the lowest rate of appreciation since the spring of 2021. Can you give us a little deeper analysis? Because there's some tricky words in there. I don't know what this guy's problem is. Single family rents are up almost 6%. Yeah, yeah it's down from 11 to 12. I've been doing this for 22 years. Rents are usually up 3%. Mm-hmm. So even though it's down to 6%, that's still 100% more than normal. They mm-hmm. need to come down. Tenants are rent burdened. And I believe, and again, and on record saying that I think apartment rents will go negative. Mm-hmm. And I believe they have in a lot of part of the country. They will go more negative. Single family is sticky. People who get into a home, even as a rental, don't want to go back to an apartment. My hope is rents in single families might go to zero. I would love to see one, two years of zero rent appreciation. We've seen a decade of rent appreciation in the last 24 months. I don't want to see 6% going forward. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what this guy's challenge is. Rents are down to 6% growth. That's still double what they used to be. I'm mean, like these reading is a good thing, folks. Please go look at the history books. Things did exist before 2020. Mm-hmm. You know, you, you, you the data's out there. There's this <clears throat> wonderful, powerful search engine called Google. You really should use it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And this is a point. This is actually to talk about Reventure Consulting again, who we're going to oh, react gosh. to some video of his here in our next segment. Um, he released videos about investors being in major trouble because rents are declining at record rates. And he was talking about, this is a great example of where they use one statistic to kind of make an a overgeneralized statement. Apartment rents are coming down, like you mentioned. So that means that all investors, especially ones in single family houses, which is the market he talks about because people who want to buy single family houses compete with investors who buy single family houses. That's evidence the whole market's crashing. And there's been a record decrease. We're at our lowest point since 2021. Yeah, you're correct. But we're still at double what healthy growth is. We, we need to keep coming down just to get back to what healthy growth is. Yes. I, I, uh, I, I don't, I don't, I try not to say his name. It, I, was there a movie where you said Baltimore like three times, some bad or Beetlejuice? That was it. Beetlejuice. I don't say his name. <laughs> well, he, he's Beetlejuice only out for himself. Movie. He's, oh, it is a great movie. I just don't say the name because I know what happens, right? It shows up. <laughs> but um, it's, uh, if you guys don't know, he tells you in black and white, he is out for himself. He put out a post the other day that says, I want to create new content, but I can't follow me over here. If you guys are not paying attention, he is not trying to help you. He's trying to get paid. 